Hello, welcome to another video. Today I'm going to be trying to make a fluid transfer pump out of the multi-purpose sprayer here from Home Depot. This is 10 bucks. I went and bought some 3 uh, inch gauge tubing, which was $3, so so far around 13, 14 bucks. So what I'm planning to do, uh, so I'm going to do a transmission uh, fluid today on a Corvette C7. My plan is, so I've got this all set up. You see you're supposed to connect the, oh, here we go. You're supposed to connect the sprayer here. So I'm thinking, obviously get rid of this because we don't need it. I'll probably cut it like right here and then throw on the tubing and then it should be able to transfer the fluid pump or the fluids since transmission fluid's pretty thin. It's not too thick. So that is what I'm planning to do and let's Hopefully see if it will work. Um, I don't know. We'll see. I know a lot of people don't want to pump the pump sprayer. It gets annoying when you have to use four quarts on a transmission. And, uh, yeah. So let's see if this works. I'm going to start cutting. Okay, moment of truth. I've already pumped this. Alright. Good amount of times. It's obviously trigger right here. I cut out I don't know, maybe a foot or something. So I'm gonna put this. Uh, where is that? There it is. Put this in there. So there it goes. So let's see. Please work. If not, oh well, hand pump it is. Oh snaps! It worked! For 10 bucks, or 13 bucks after buying two. So what we're doing is just taking some of the old transmission fluid out so it's fully, so it gets full amount. What's nice is you can just take your hand off the trigger here, stop pumping. So we're gonna wait for this to uh, stop dripping. That should get all the old trans out, trans fluid out, and then uh, we're gonna plug it up and then do it again. So there you go. This is one gallon, so it should be able to hold uh, four quarts. And that's uh, the amount it takes for this transmission on the Corvette. Mine's about three and a half, four. And then that's it. Controlled by just holding this, which is a lot better than hand pumping. How long will this last? I don't know. I don't know if this fluids are gonna eat through the seals and stuff on the, uh, on the pump, but I don't know, just something to try out. Looks like it's working pretty well. I'm surprised that worked, but it did. So that's an easy, cheap way to get, make your own little fluid transfer pump for 13 bucks.